Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more Let's Play Metroid Zero Mission. We've crash landed on the land of Chizodia without any equipment or weaponry. We have a pistol, but the only thing the pistol can do is stun enemies, so we're uh, kind of outmatched really. <laughs> so now we have to uh, deal with these space pirates while trying to find another weapon of sorts. And let's go for it. Ah, shoot. Ah. thing to keep in mind is these guys are powerful and you cannot kill them. You can stun them, but that's really all you can do. Otherwise, you are at their complete mercy. And that is not a fun thing. You quite literally have to find your way through this place without, without getting killed, pretty much. A lot of things you gotta look out for, though. Oh, dang it. Ah, get away from me. What did I do? I don't care if I'm trespassing. I'm a bounty hunter. I'm supposed to trespass. So, yeah, you pretty much have to uh, find a way to escape these guys. You'll find uh, some hiding places as you go through. Like this. He cannot see me, so thus the alarm will go off and we can continue. Oh, okay. Well, this looks like a decent escape ship. I think we could probably use that to our advantage to get out of here, but... Oh no, we have no means of actually uh, breaking through that door, though, so... Guess it's not over yet. Definitely use the save station to uh, save and also put your energy back to normal. It's going to be a very vital part of this section. Okay, so now we need to climb up. I have a feeling that at some point we're going to get caught by the alarm again. It kind of just goes without saying. And, oh, okay. Ah, oh, God! Hey, now. That's not funny or fair. Ah! Oh, okay, you can use that to kill themselves. That's kind of funny. I guess that is kind of a clever thing to do. Okay, can you go away please? Thank you. Okay, let's keep going. What the hell? Searchlights? I know what to expect here. Gotta look out for those things. They shine on ya. We know that alarm's gonna go back off again. Okay, well I can't get up there. If I still had my screw attack, I could, but... <laughs> Unfortunately, we are unarmed, as you guys already know. As we're constantly reminded in this world of adversity. Okay, let's see. Oh boy. Now, whose idea was this? <laughs> Seriously, whose idea was this? This is... Oh, boy. This is like... Acrobatics through missiles. Or not missiles, through lasers. Oh, no. Dang it. I almost made it, though. I think that was like the first time I... Uh... Almost did that without tripping the lasers. The lasers are really, really hard to dodge, honestly. <laughs> I opened that door. They didn't even see me there. That's hilarious. Ah! Okay, so they do know how to use those hiding places. 
I, I just kind of expected that they didn't, uh, you know. Ah. Get away from me. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Run for your life. <laughs> Run for your life. Oh no, they're chasing me again. I mean, they're always chasing me, so it's not really saying a whole lot, but... I want to go home. Okay. Just run in the next room, see if I care. It doesn't matter to me. I'm cool with that. Energy tank. Recharge complete. And I'll go ahead and save again. So now we're in the Chozo Ruins. We're not just in Kazodia anymore. Why are there searchlights in ruins? Are they really expecting me to be here in a ruin? Although, although maybe the space pirates are just here, like, looking for the secrets of the Chozo. You know, their complicated plan. I love how the space pirate got stunned, but he didn't... He didn't think much about it. He's like, okay, well, I got stunned right there. <laughs> I'm just going to ignore that and pretend it didn't happen. I mean, that helps me out in the long run, but... Hmm. Yep. I figured there'd be... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh boy. I know I have an idea of what we're going to be doing right here. I'm going to jump up here when it gets safe. What? I mean, I guess they could see my foot, but <laughs> come on now. This is neither here nor there for the place of foot. What? How'd you see me? Ah! Now he can't see me. Frickin' weirdo. <laughs> frickin' frickin' weirdo. I really, really thought I was safe right there. I should have been. It's an insult to injury that I was not safe there. Ooh, seductive. <laughs> that really did look weirdly suggestive. And seductive. I don't know why. Hey! I wanted that. You know, that looked like something I could have used. It's a weapon. Maybe I didn't have the morph ball to actually use it, but, uh, it was something. It was definitely something. And they just took it away. They just took it. They took it away. They took it. Hey! It's mine! I will kill you! Or not. I'll wait for uh, killing later, I guess. Is this thing gonna get my foot again? He's so gonna get my foot again. It's not even funny. This guy in foot... God. Does he go all the way down? He does. Okay, no, he doesn't go all the way down. He went most of the way down. Can you see my ponytail? Oh, yeah, you probably can. I'm not even going to risk it. 
Now, if you were doing a speed run for this game, you'd definitely just, like, plow through here. Oh, pfft. To be fair, I did walk up to the guy and shoot him. That probably wasn't smart. That probably wasn't the smartest thing. I'm wondering if I could have even, uh... Yeah, I probably could have avoided capture there. I think it's definitely possible. Oh no, oh no. Ah. What did I do? Oh right, trespassing. Uh. Run, Samus! Run like you have the speed booster, which... Yeah, you really should have used that. Ha <laughs> I win, I win, I win, I win. I say that when they could easily kill me. <laughs> oh god. This is fun. I love this part of the game. It's, you know, it's a lot different than what you're used to. You don't expect stealth, really, in a Metroid game, but... It's kind of it's kind of cool, honestly. I like it. I approve of it. It is something I approve of. I think that this uh, game did a great job with it, honestly. Nope. What the? These look like retired Pokemon rejects. No, they're the Chozo. The Chozo Warriors. And, uh... Chozo Sage. <gasps> Samus as a babby! She hasn't changed one bit. So, now we have a boss battle slash puzzle to do. What we have to do is we have to uh, target this thing whenever the I power up icon appears. If we don't and shoot the ball as it is, we'll take damage instead. No, oh, damn it. Oh, come on, I hit that. There we go. For some reason, this reminds me of one of the final battles of Mischief Makers. Oh, jeez. Come on, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, and those things really hurt, too. Got it! Wahey! 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 That looks like me! <gasps> Do I get my suit back? I hope so. That'd make things a lot easier. We do! But not just that. The three unknown items we collected throughout the game have actually shown their true potential. We get the plasma beam. This powerful beam can blast through multiple enemies. We have the Gravity Suit, which reduces damage from foes, enables free movement in water, and stops lava damage. And finally, we have the Space Jump, Somersault Continually in the Air. Use A, Mid-Somersault, to jump again. You got your fully powered suit. Awesome. So not only do we have our suit back, we have Super Powerful Mode, and oh my god... I am ready for frickin' action. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Could you kill me earlier? Well, you can't now. Oh, my 
god, this is this is what it's all about, guys. Completely wrecking face. That's what this is. Oh man, I feel good. I feel good. Da -da 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 -da. I knew that I would now, yeah. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm I'm really excited about this development as you can plainly see. Okay, I do not want my super missiles. That's not something I want. Okay, so there's a super missile tank right off the bat. I have a feeling you're going to want to run through this and get it. Alright. Let's see. Now we need to keep on moving. Let's see, anything else worth mentioning? Oh yeah, now we can freaking do this now too. Oh, this is so good. I love being able to jump like this. It's so freaking good. Hey. Also, whenever the alarm goes off and the door shuts, all you need to do is just, uh... Just freaking shoot. I want to say this is actually a puzzle you need to do later. I think so, anyway. I think it is. Oh, jeez. And if it is, I hate this puzzle. Okay, I see you right there. Thank you, missile. all the way down, destroy, utterly destroy these, oh, power bombs, I think we'll need to find those still, you know, because it's a thing we'll need to do, what's this, what's the point of this room? Is there really any point to this? No, I don't think so. Hmm. Oh, maybe to get under there if the alarm's still going. That's probably what that is. I can, uh, I can, I can deal with that. Also, notice how we're not taking damage anymore. Oh, uh, so freaking good. So freaking good. Oh boy. I would like to have those power bombs though. I would like to know where those fools took my items. Because you know what? Power bombs, they sound pretty good right now, honestly. They really, really do. Also, out of, uh,. Curiosity here in a second. Um, let's take a look at our map. Oh boy, we have a lot of stuff uh, opened up right now. A lot and a lot of stuff. Okay, unfortunately, this guy's. Can we open the door, please? I would like that. I mean, we don't need to, but. If you don't want to, that's fine. I can just, uh, you know, go and do things this way. Hello, Mr. Missile Tank? Ah, there you are. Missile? Yep, that's what I thought. Another super missile. Now we can actually start making our way to the next part of the area where we're going to get our new items. I'm also going to check something else. Do we have... Okay, not yet. I was actually wondering if we were going to get the ability to see how many uh, tanks we have left in general, but I don't think we have that just yet. 
I think maybe once you get the last item, you'll uh, open that feature up. Uh, basically, at some point in the game, you have the capabilities of seeing how many tanks you have left in certain areas, which is really, really helpful for uh, this game. Because it allows you to actually see what you're missing, and, you know, if you don't have an idea, if you have, like, some sort of idea where the last items are you need and like what location you can at least uh, start looking in all the rooms to find it which I think is really nice 